For half a century, Professor Marilyn Renfrey has been studying the reproduction and development of Australian mammals. We're actually sitting on a biological gold mine. And that's why I have so many fantastic international collaborators, because they all want to work on marsupials. After five decades, she's still passionate about research, teaching, and is a committed conservationist. If you discover something you know, new that no one's ever discovered before, it's very exciting. And you, you, know, you talk about it with your colleagues and your students and everybody gets excited. In her distinguished career, she's made numerous discoveries, including the fact that the marsupial placenta is fully functional, just like those of other mammals. We also work on lactation because marsupials are, are, are the lactational specialists of the mammalian world. They have a very sophisticated milk which changes in composition throughout the whole of lactation. Human milk is like early marsupial milk. Cow's milk is like late marsupial milk. She also discovered that certain genes directly control sexual development during pregnancy and even after birth in marsupials. I use marsupials as biomedical models to tell us about processes that are difficult to study in humans. And one of our major programs is on sex differentiation. That's because marsupials are born with undifferentiated gonads. You can't tell if it's an ovary or a testis. And that all happens while they're growing in the pouch. Whereas in us, it's happening at six to eight weeks in utero. A pioneer in her field and a trailblazer for women in STEM, Professor Renfrey is also a mother to two daughters. No matter what else I've done, the most important thing I've ever done in my life is have those two girls. And at 72, she's showing no sign of slowing down. The work is still exciting. I've still got lots to do. I've got lots of papers to write up. Great bunch of students. The Australian Academy of Science, because questions need answers.